Evolution of Metal Casting Casting is a manufacturing process, in which a liquid material is usually poured into a mold, which contains a hollow cavity of the desired shape, and then allowed to solidify. The oldest casting in existence, is believed to be a copper frog, cast in Mesopotamia around 3200 BC. Progress in casting was necessary slow from pure copper. Early man moved to bronze casting, when he learned sometimes around 3000 BC probably by accident, that the addition of tin to molten copper, produce a much more useful material. Bronze was harder than copper, and could be hardened more easily. The discovery of tin as a separate element, did not take place until the 16th century, but by then, man had already used it ores for thousands of years, in combination with those of copper. The first production of iron casting, is attributed to the Chinese at a time shortly after 1000 BC. Since iron does not occur on earth in native form, and could hardly have been smelted 6000 years ago, its origin has been attributed to meteorite in which it is found unoxidized, but this contention has also been debated. Developments in metal casting came swiftly in the 14th and 15th centuries. By 1500, cast iron, a brittle but still useful engineering material, was extensively used in the West. The blast furnace had been established, and pig iron introduced, pointing the way to iron and steel molding. The new era of foundry development, which opened with the end of the Dark Ages, was well underway by the close of the 15th century. 1642, Saugus Iron Works, America's first iron foundry is established near Lynn, Massachusetts. The first America iron casting, the Saugus pot is poured there. 1709, Englishman Abraham Darby, creates the first true foundry flask, for sand and loam molding. 1720, René Antoine de Riomur, develops the first malleable iron, known today as European White Heart. 1730, Abraham Darby, is the first to use coke as fuel in his melting furnace, in Coalbrookdale, England. 1750, Benjamin Huntsman, reinvent the process of cast crucible steel in England. This process, is the first in which steel is completely melted, producing a uniform composition within the melt. Since the metal is completely molten. 1796, first use of the cupola in iron foundry, invented by John Wilkinson of England. The original had metal cladding, and utilized a steam engine to provide the air blast. 1809, centrifugal casting also known as spin casting, is developed by A.G. Eckhart of Soho, England. 1818, first cast steel, produced by the crucible process in the US, at the Valley Forge Foundry. 1826, Seth Boyden of Newark, New Jersey, is the first to develop a process for, and produce Blackheart malleable iron. 1837, first dependable molding machine, is marketed and used by the S. Jarvis Adam Company in Pittsburgh. 1845, the open hearth furnace is developed. 1851, Sir Henry Bessemer and William Kelly, both invented a simple converter, that uses blast of air to burn out the impurities, silicon, manganese, and excess carbon in pig iron. This is known as the Bessemer converter. 1870, sandblasting, is first used to clean large casting, by R. E. Tillman of Philadelphia. 1887, the Sly Tumbling Mill is developed. It is the first cleaning machine for small castings. This mill greatly reduced the time needed for hand cleaning operations, and produced a finer finished product. 1897, investment casting is rediscovered by B.F. Philbrook of Lower. He uses it to cast dental inlays. 1906, first electric arc furnace, is used in the U.S., at Holcomb Steel Company in Syracuse, New York. 1913, first true stainless steel, melted by Henry Brierke in Sheffield, England. 1924, Dr. W. H. Hatfield invented 18% chromium, 8% nickel stainless steel, also known as 18 eighths stainless steel. 1940, wood flour is introduced into foundry practice, as a sand additive. 1948, development of ductile iron, a cast iron with a fully spheroidal graphite structure. 1953, the hotbox system of making and curing cores in one operations is developed, eliminating the need for dielectric drying ovens. 1958, H. 
F. Schroyer, was granted a patent for the full mold process, the forerunner of the expendable pattern, lost foam, casting process. 1960s, compactability and methylene blue clay test, are developed for green sand control. Also developed at this time, are high pressure molding processes, and fast setting no bake binder for sand. 1964, the first disomatic molding machine is introduced. 1968, the cold box process, is introduced by L. Toriello and J. Robbins for high production core. 1971, the Japanese developed V-process molding. This method uses unbonded sand and a vacuum. 1972, the first production ostempered ductile iron component, is produced by Wagner Casting Company. 1982, the warm box binder system is introduced. 1997, electromagnetic casting processes, developed by Argon and Inland Steel Corporation. This process, greatly reduces lost, and energy expenditure in steel production.